Today we are back to have another fun adventure in solo queue. And it looks like we are pretty lucky today because we have a tank player in our team and he already picked Franco. So I don't get why he's asking for Tigreal. You know what? I'm kind of a team player myself so I'm going to lock Tigreal and maybe switch it with him and I'll go Franco to the side lane. Yep, you heard me, we're gonna go side lane with Franco. And I'm sure that's not a problem, we're only gonna be dealing with... Oh uh, crap, it's Esmeralda. But that is fine, how hard can it be? I'm just gonna go around here like any good Franco user, which I'm not. And be very annoying. Oh, you think you can uh, try to scare me with your squid face? Not before I reset your buff. And with that, my job here is done. Time to deal with this Esmeralda. And by dealing with her, I meant we're just gonna let her push and I'm gonna safely uh, destroy these minions under my tower. And it's not that I'm scared, it's just, um, it's just, uh, I uh, respect her. See, I'm even keeping her company while she's shamelessly cutting the minion waves behind my tower. Yep, she's just gonna keep doing that, isn't she? Just gonna cut behind my lane and force me to defend. But there's a team fight over here and there's a lot of low HP enemies that I cannot grab. But that is fine because if there's anyone I wanted to grab, it's definitely Esmeralda. And that shenanigan landed our team two kills. Okay, I didn't get any assists, but uh, that's okay. Yep, she's just gonna keep doing this thing unless I do something about it. The only problem is I gotta figure out what that thing I need to do is. So while we're waiting for my brain to kick in, we're just gonna keep clearing these minions and yes, I'm getting cursed helmet so I can clear the waves faster. And it looks like Esmeralda really made the backside of my tower her permanent residence. How about you get in here and make yourself feel more comfortable by uh, laying on the ground. See? Home sweet home. Meanwhile, our Lancelot is trying to cook up some nice turtle soup, but there's only three of us here, so I guess I'm just gonna give this Esmeralda a friendly massage and ask her to relax and not to kill any more of our teammates. Look out, there are sharks, see how I saved you? I really am your friend. There should be no doubt about it by now. But the enemies got the turtle and somebody else ended up dying and I'm still wondering what Chang e is doing tagging along with Irithel in the top lane. And as usual, we're back to the bot lane where we try our hardest to defend against Esmeralda's minions. But it looks like she wants another round of full body massage and you know what, the pleasure is all mine. Damn, she uh, she run off without paying for my services and that is okay. Because to be honest, if she'll let me massage her, I'll be the one paying. So they're fighting over the turtle again and I think this is the first time ever that we have pushed our minions toward Esmeralda's tower. In the meantime, I think we're gonna lose this turtle again unless I do something about it, which I can't. So we're just gonna see if we can distract at least one of them away from the turtle so that our jungler can make a miracle. I did not expect that to happen, but I'm glad that it did. Alright team, that is it. Keep doing that and eventually by punching this tower I can take it down. Thank you so much minion. But the fight is not over because the enemies are pretty mad that a Franco took down their bot lane tower. And they're taking it all out on our teammate which is pretty good. I mean, uh, I mean it's pretty bad but I'm pretty thankful that they didn't go for me. And it looks like their revenge arc is not over yet because they are also stealing our red buff. They may have gotten it but I'm gonna make sure that they exchange a whole horse for it and we're back to clearing our lane because our job is not over until their tower is destroyed but I think my teammates need me so we're gonna head over there and hopefully save Lancelot from this Esmeralda by giving her another one of my friendly massages and with a sprinkle of golden shower from Chang E wait service is not over until you are relaxed and comfortably lying on the ground Meanwhile, I think Lancelot is about to relax on the ground as well, so uh, let's get out of here. Oh man, this horse meat is pretty tanky. Yeah, we're definitely not gonna aim for him if we can always aim for something squishier like this Brody. Now all I need is for my teammates to um, follow up. But uh, yeah, I didn't look at the map. They were doing something else. 
But that is fine because while we were dead they were fighting and now they got the Lord. Ain't that a surprise? And speaking of surprises, I'm pretty sure that there's tons of enemies in this bush. So all we need now is for someone to deal enough damage to finish them off and that is not happening so that's why I think I'm just gonna do it myself. Esmeralda? More like Esmeralda. Hylos? More like Hylos. Wait, uh, why am I being mean again? I, uh, I forgot. I think we got this game right. We took down two of their towers and there's only two people defending their tower. Actually, it's one person and one squid. So I think we have a better chance of uh, ending this game if only I can stop hitting something aside from Natalia. You know what, let's try that again. And this time we're gonna go for some seafood. Ah, there we go, a drunken squid. See kids, getting drunk is bad, so don't do it. Oh, but it also gives you the power to summon an army of sharks, I see. Okay, maybe it's a little bit cool, but this team fight isn't over yet because my teammates keep fighting the enemies and I think we're gonna lose this battle if we don't back off for now. But hey, our Lancelot is unstoppable. That means we can end it now, right? So I'm just gonna run around here and see if we can hook someone, like this Natalia again. Yeah, I think we should get out of here because we're out of minions and the Lord is actually up. And my teammates immediately got on the job. And it's a good thing that the enemies are endlessly defending their base because we got the Lord nice and easy. And with the Lord up, I think I'm just gonna go to the bot lane and clear the minions so that we can have these minions crash to their towers as well. But I wanna be part of the picture. Like I always say, winning is important, but having a nice victory selfie is importanter. But first, we gotta make sure that they don't kill this Lord without getting to their base. And also, we hooked a random horse. Okay, you guys take care of that. And I'm just gonna go around here because I think this game is about to end. We'll find a nice spot and okay, I'll, uh, I'll sell for that. It's a side view victory selfie. It's not so bad. The camera got my uh, good side. And just like we planned, we got gold and it's a 6.9. It's not so bad because it's the best. So uh, Franco XP lane, that was such a fun fun thing to do but I would not recommend it if it's the last thing that I need to recommend. But I hope you enjoyed this match as much as I did and I hope you're still staying safe and staying healthy. And again my name is Shin Takazo. thank you so much for watching these videos. Please check out the previous ones for the many and different heroes we played in the past. Hit like and subscribe if you enjoy this kind of content and as always I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.